Welcome, guys, to the, uh, Innator Army Year End Wrap-Up Pre-Show. Straight, coming straight from the stage just outside of Enderman Burial Center on the party square. On the in the Innator Square, that's where that's where we are. <laughs> but hey, we're here. We're ready. It's time to get this started, and we got a lot to show. And some things are gonna probably be really shocking to you guys. <laughs> What's gonna be introduced on that stage in just a little bit? But um, it this is going to be the biggest one we've ever put together so guess you guys need to sit back and relax and we will see you on this stage after the first quarter Come on, get a bullseye. Get get a bullseye. No, that's not bullseye. Get bullseye. Bullseye! Yay! Oh, Spark, what you doing here? What you doing here, buddy? Hey, how you doing? Oh. Oh crap. Uh oh. I'm late. <laughs> Come on. Hey, bud. Hey, hey. Let's go. <laughs> I can't believe I might. I, I, I just can't. I can't believe it. How, how could I've been so silly and completely forget about what's happening tonight? Come on, come on, buddy. Come on, bud. Hurry, go faster, horse. Come on, come on, we're on the highway. We could go as fast as possible now. Come on, come on, come on, horse. Get there, come on. Move faster. Come on, hurry up, we gotta get there.
Hurry up. Finally! We've made it! We've made it! Yay! Finally! Whew! Come on, come on, come on, I need to get to the change room. Come on! Get moving! Huh. <sighs> Finally! I made it!
please welcome the head of the Inator Army. Game Inator 5, Inator. What is up, Inator Army? I am Gaminator5 coming at you with another video. What is up, everybody? It is a very special video today. It is the year and wrap up of 2019 it is a big one we always do these and as i've said in the pre-show it is the biggest one we've ever put together so we have a lot to get through and it is going to be fun so first things first from all of us here at the innate army i would like to welcome you to the fifth ever annual Inator Army year and wrap up of 2019. And as I've said, this is the biggest and we're gonna have fun with it. We're going to show off some new things. We're gonna show you some new trailers for projects that we've worked on. We're gonna tell you some stuff that we told you we were going to talk about this on the stage that we're on right now so we got a lot to get through so it's gonna be fun and hopefully you guys will stick through we got a lot to show we got dates to unveil things to unveil it is going to be insane and it's going to be awesome and we have Broken this year's uh, year end wrap up into three quarters. I've said this, um, I've said that a lot of our big things are taking place in the second quarter. That's probably going to be the big quarter, but um, that it really is going to be probably the biggest one we've ever put together. Well, what am I saying? I know it is. I've already had to make all the trailers. That was insane. That was annoying. Very annoying, but without further ado, let's get into it. Let's move to the first part, and that is the first set of awards. Now, as you know, if you've watched these year end wrap ups before, you know that every year we We give off to, we keep aside two of the many awards, especially this year where we have a lot, and I mean a lot of awards this year. We keep off two awards and we dedicate them to the fans. So for this year also, we have two awards to give to you guys. So... Without further ado, let's get into it. Let's show, let's give you the awards for, let's tell you who's won the awards for the, the fan awards. Awards to you guys. Pretty much. Let me just open it up here. Okay. Now. I didn't make anything on here for it, I made something offline, but still something. Being that we don't have a wall, I was thinking of doing that, but I didn't do it. So, uh, I screwed it. <laughs> but, um, of course, every year we do this, we do the, the subscriber of the year. It, it could be... That you could be the most active in the comments. You could um, give us tips on videos about certain things. Or just a, 
like I said, a very active person in the comments, and this person is beyond active. He's insanely active. <laughs> and the YouTube Gaming Subscriber of the Year for the season of Infection is... Vines Boys eighty nine. That's 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 the name of that's the name of the user. I might do a wall if I do a wall I'll post it to social media, so watch closely. I'm probably not gonna do a wall. But if I do a wall here, I also have to do a wall at uh the main one. No I do I and uh, next year's and the years after that. But, um, the other one I do have a wall for. I don't have a sign though. Huh. Should I grab? I should have thought of this. <laughs> okay, got a sign. It's time for the to give away the Google Plus. Thank you, game. It's time to give out the Google Plus comment of the year. As you see on this big wall, we only have two, even though we've done this. This is the fifth ever annual. And this is the fifth one we've done. Um, I just haven't moved to. <laughs> we did two in uh, another place. Yeah. I think it's the fifth. We've done a lot of these. <laughs> but um yeah so right here for the season of infection the google plus coming of the year award goes to Silver spoons, one, two, three. <laughs> and I'm not gonna put the entire comment. I don't really have full um evidence of it, but I know it came being that it was on a live stream. It was in one of the live streams chat um things. So, yeah, if, if uh, you want to go, it started something real weird in the video, in the stream, and if you want to go check it out, Nader Village Part 2 Toilet, <laughs> and it, the name says enough, <laughs> the name of the episode was, as you know, I named the episodes after I'm done streaming and I think of something that was good in the episode. You brought up being that I was doing a tour of my house, old house, before it lit on fire. And uh, I showed him a toilet, and he wondered if it flushed. I said that it didn't flush. <laughs> <laughs> so that just turned into another thing. <laughs> so, that is on. That is the comment of the year for the season of infection <laughs> so moving onwards ah, let's just go back up on the stage and never talk about this again <laughs> now before we get to the big Things that all the awards are in envelopes. <laughs> They're confidential. Very confidential. <laughs> and this year, I wanted to do this, and um, uh, let's hope it goes well. So.
as you guys um know, every year we uh every year there's predictions made on YouTube and I think we did pretty good this last year. As this August, I can tell you exactly how many views we got this August, and it's insane. I wouldn't have expected getting this many in one month. <laughs> but so much has happened this past season that um, it, it was at the most successful season we've had um, in our six years of being a uh, part of YouTube. And um, we don't know how it's going to happen this next year, but we know no matter what, if we have you guys with us, it's going to be a blast. We'll keep pumping up the content at good paces. We have our Upload times out. If you didn't see them, go check out the Nader Army Video Services Media Day, which uploaded Tuesday. And go check that out, being that we um, announced our upload times for this upcoming season. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Over the entire month of August, we have had a total of 92 views. And oh, since the last time we did our um, year-end wrap-up, we have had 897 views total on the channel. And to be honest, that is insane. The channel has reached a length that I ne never would have thought would be possible. But it's po it clearly is possible that being that we've done it but it still s shocks me so much that we've done so well this year and yeah so really from the bottom of my heart thank you for um also all the support over these years and Hopefully we won't slow down anytime soon, and hopefully we'll get fast, and get better in the coming years. Being that maybe after this year we'll be able to put more time towards this. Just don't quote me on that. <laughs> but um, without further ado, let's get. To the Innate Army Crew Awards. Every year, starting last year, we started giving out awards to our crew. And we um, got a lot, a big response on this. And it really gives uh, our, uh, everyone in the crew something to work towards every year. As you know, every year we do Game Nair of the Year. You thought, you weren't seeing that already. Game Year of the Year was crowned as DJ Pickle, the new kid on the block, took home the Game Year of the Year um, title this year, and that was awesome. And it was his first year running, and he won. I feel I find that awesome. That hasn't happened since the first year we did it, obviously. <laughs> but um. Before we get to the actual words to our crew, I 
thought that this was one of the awards we had last year, and to the game we've we've had three games. I can't remember them all on off the top of my head that f were finalists for the um award, but we have a award that goes out to um one of the uh top games on the channel this year this past season I mean and that is the Twitter game of the season award and it was the finalists I brought I was able to bring it up were Fortnite Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens and Lego DC Super Villains I can't, I can't, I can't remember. No, I put them in random name generator. And the winner of the... It took me a bit to get it out of the envelope. <laughs> Should have done that in advance. But I guess it kind of uh, brings up the anticipation. The winner of the Twitter Game of the Season award for the Season of Infection is... Hmm. One of the <laughs> biggest games of uh, now of the generation. The winner is Fortnite. That, that is right, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Fortnite has won the Twitter Game of the Season Award. And... I know some people are probably, I know it's sort of gone away, but it, I've had some fun, and I, like I said, it wasn't my decision. I put it in a random name thing, and that's what came out. So, Fortnite won. Eh, oh well. <laughs> to all the other games. Good luck next year. And maybe, maybe those other games that didn't make it uh, into the game of the season, maybe they'll get the game of the year award that we give out in Decem on December 31st. So, I know that one's kind of controversial. No one's probably going to like that. But hey, I don't care. If you don't like it, you can you can tell me in the comment section and get and yell at me. But please don't do that. <laughs> but you could, but don't. Okay. Let's let's move on. The next award for this year actually requires me to go get a banner. I think. Unless, actually, let's just wait here, and we'll see if I need to go get a banner, being that, if you didn't know, last year, the Twitch most valued streamer, where's his poll? Or your poll? Right here. Right there was, uh, strawberries. And, um, if he wins again... I don't really need to put any banner up on his poll, be it that he already has banner. <laughs> so, this year, the Twitch Most Valued Streamer finalists, I'll tell you the finalists. Me and Strawberries were the finalists for this award. So, let's, uh... 
Let's open this. This one's opening a lot, lot easier. The Twitch Most Valued Streamer Award for the season of Infection goes to... I don't need a banner. <laughs> it, it goes once again for the second season in a row. The winner is... Strawberries in Nader. So he won it again. I'll, I'll just climb up. I'll show you the banner on his pole. Where's the banner? Banner? Yeah, it's up here. Ah! What the heck is wrong with you? Screw you. <laughs> That's all I can say. That's annoying. <laughs> what the? That's unprofessional. <laughs> there we go. Oh, perfect. All right. Okay. Where? This guy. That's fine. There. That one right there. The purple and white banner. <laughs> so. Next award. The next award for this season. It's a brand new award at that. It is. The Instagram Poster of the Year Award. I'm definitely going to need a banner for this one, but uh, I'm not going to grab it yet. <laughs> I don't know who's going to get it. Now, the Poster of the Year Award, it, it, you don't just have to be posting on Instagram. You can be posting to YouTube. Any of our social media platforms. And, um, Instagram would be more, but all of them. And, uh, I will tell you the finalists for this award. Where the heck is it? The Instagram Poster of the Year Award finalists were me, Gamerator5, and I. So, the winner of the Instagram Poster of the Year Award is... The Instagram Poster of the Year Award goes to... The award goes to, and is her, the first ever award. Being that she didn't win any last year. She didn't win any the year before, obviously, being that we just started last year. And... The winner is I E Nader. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs>
Okay. Put that over here. And let's go get a banner. Oh, come on. I don't even have the banner in here. <laughs> in between the logos. Hey. It must be up there. If not, this is going to be real funny as I'm going to need to cut this and find it. It's in here! <laughs> I'm big! I'm big, boys! Okay. The poster of the year goes to this one right here. And it's going... Actually, no, it's, it's a top one. It's a top one at the moment, being that she doesn't have any other awards. There we go! First award! Even though she has other banners, but first award! <laughs> Why do I like doing that? <laughs> okay. The next award. For this season is the Friendly Picks Photographer of the Year Award. I think there was only one person that finalized for this one. <laughs> so let's just open it. I'm not going to tell you, being that I'm pretty sure I know who's won it. <laughs> Okay. The winner of the Friendly Picks Photographer of the Year Award is me. <laughs> The winner is, it literally says, the winner is Gaminator 5. So, yay! I won one! <laughs> I would need to go track down that one. <laughs> That's why I stood here. Excuse me! You! It in you! It in here! Yeah, it's right here. I'm just gonna put them in, being that I'm afraid that not a lot of these are in there. Wow, we have a lot of crap, don't we? There we go. Okay, that's all fixed. Let's go stick this on mine. The one that has quite a bit. <laughs> quite a bit on it. That's me! Okay, which side does this go on? It goes on this side! There we go. Photographer of the year. That's awesome. Weehee! So, obviously, next award. And this one is a weird one. It's going to take some explaining. It is another new award. This year, the last one was new also. This one's new also. It is the Snapchat Streaker of the Year Award. 
If you didn't know, we are on Snapchat, so go follow us. But, um, the Snapchat streaker award, I will tell you who was finalized for this one. Even though I should be telling you first what you need to do, what we need to do to get this one. Oh, wow, only two of us. <laughs> Me and strawberries. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> the streak of the year. It could be the streak of streams you've had, the streak of videos you've uploaded, the streak of posts you've had on social media. Pretty much anything, if that makes sense. So let's uh, let's crack this. Uh, I'm gonna crack this one open also. Until and, and I'll tell you who the winner is. Oh, great! This one's not opening that well. Okay, got it out. The word for the Snapchat the streaker, the winner of the Snapchat streaker of the year award is me. As I just banged my elbow on the desk. <laughs> Ouch! That hurt it. That hurt it quite a bit. Ah. <sighs> oh, yeah, my entire arm just went numb. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but yeah. The winner is me. Again. Could put a lot of our names on repeat now. I feel. Snapchat Streaker of the Year. Hey! Where's my. Where's my. Where is that? Boy! <laughs> There we go. Oh god, I ran out of space. I might have to stick a couple on the back. <laughs> Jeez. I've won a lot of awards already. Hey, oi, I don't need you in there. Oh, what are you doing? Get out of there. <laughs> oh, what is wrong with me? Okay. The next award. I already know the winner. I already know the winner of this one. Do I even need a... Guess I do. But I don't think there's a banner for this one. Actually, no. Yes, there is. There was a fly that just flew by me. Really annoying. This one opened very fast. Then uh, I didn't say what the award was. The award was uh, the war This award is the Gamer Talk Best Rages. Being that there's only been really one person on Gamer Talk besides DJ. And one or two, I can't remember. I think it was one. I think it was two. I can't remember how many he's been in, but, um, yeah, it's kind of obvious, the winner of the Gamer Talk Best Rages Award, oh, wow, shocker, it's me, okay, let's go get another banner, <laughs> it's also, of course, it's a new one, being that Gamer Talk is a new thing this year, but, uh, <laughs> is that, the best rages one. It has a metal. <laughs> has metal in the middle. I did break the boat. Ow! <laughs> oh. 
I've completely run out of space. I can't go there. <laughs> mm. Goodbye. <laughs> Hope to God I don't win any more. <laughs> As my my pillar is filling up rapidly. Okay, next award. What is the next award? Eh, to pick up you stupid thing. Might have to make the poles bigger <laughs> because of how many awards we have now. This isn't one to us. I should have done this one one of the first two also, but hey. It is another new award. It is the Face It Tournament Champion of the Year. And if you didn't know, we ran a tournament back in Easter long weekend. We ran it. And it was a uh, team, team Fortress. Yeah, Team Fortress 2 tournament, and of course, I want to give thanks to the winner. Okay. Of course, the team that won the tournament was not us. I could say that not us, or I would have been real annoyed as I would have been going to around every single pillar and sticking one on. I would have been real annoying. The winner is Shock Wave United. Of Canada, but yeah, Shockwave United, they won. <laughs> it's annoying. Stupid. <laughs> now, the Sports Talk Most Athletic Award. This one is back to our crew, and who's gonna win it? <laughs> Well, I could tell you who was finalized for this one. Sports talk. Me, me, and me and strawberries. So let's let's open it. I don't know who will win this one. The sports talk. Most athletic award goes to. Oh God! The good thing is I don't think we have a banner for this one. The winner is me. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I have a banner for that one or not. Let's check. No, no, I don't. I don't have one. <laughs> I don't have one for that. Yay! <laughs> okay, next award. Let's move past this. Another, another winner of this award also. Good God. <laughs> Everybody, start doing things. The Inner Post Article of the Year Award is the next award. I didn't say that. I'm really sucking at this. I'm not telling you this. And the winner is... It's not going to be a shocker. I'm the only one that's posted something. Let me guess. It's me. Yeah, yeah, it's me. <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> that one we have a banner for. I know that. 
That's this one. <laughs> Article of the year. Okay. Ah, oh, crap. Where's this going to go? I can't go on this side. <laughs> I have to go on the back. There we go. Perfect. That's not gonna get annoying. I might have to add something in the... Ah, I can't add being that this is all before... Ah, crap. <laughs> That's annoying. And the next award is the Anita Publishing Academic Award. I don't think we have something for this one either. I will go check. <laughs> nope. No, we don't have one for this. I think we were supposed to, but we don't. <laughs> okay. The winner for the winner of the Adair Publishing Academic Award is open. That's not, that's not who won. I'm opening the letter. I'm opening the envelope that has it in it. The winner of the Indator Publishing Academic Award is... I, she don't get a banner, but I, she won. Congrats. <laughs> let's go, let's put that one right there. Good. Okay, next award. <laughs> let's get these out of here. <laughs> okay. Next award is the Native World Most Dedicated Member Award. After this, we have three to go. <laughs> Three to go after this one. So let's open this one. I can tell you who's finalized for this one. The last ones I didn't really want to, but I, I can show you th these. These were the big ones. This is the Indator World Most Dedicated. It's very new. Wow. Um, me, DJ, and I. We're all nominated for this one. <laughs> We're all finalists. Okay. The winner of the Native World Most Dedicated Member Award is... Uh. The good thing is he has spots, I think. Uh, not a lot, but he does. Um, <laughs> the winner of the Native World Most Dedicated Member Award is the winningest member of the entire crew and Gaminator of the Year. DJ Pickle. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> and I know there's a banner for this one, just I don't think I named it. I think this is it. Yeah, yeah, this is it. There's a lot of banners. Jesus. Okay, this one. Let's go this side. <laughs> It might be going on to the back also. Jeez. Look how many awards this guy's got. Oh my god. <laughs> uh. <laughs> he, yeah, he really is winning us. Well, I might have taken him over f at the beginning, but he might, depending if he gets another one, he might overtake me again. And then the third to last award, the Google Group's Most 
Active Member Award. And the Google group, so let's open it. I can, no. Stupid phone. I will tell you who was not uh, finalized for this one. Where? Where? Where are you all? Ah. The finalists were me, I, and DJ. Wow. The three of us were around quite a bit, weren't we? <laughs> Come on. Open. 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 Good. Ha. The winner of the Google Mo Group's Most Active Member Award is... Huh. <laughs> the, wi the winner is DJ Pickle again. <laughs> well, so, who, this one was around last year. Who won it? I think it was around last year. No, it wasn't. I don't think it was. Let's go grab it. Most active member. Nope, no one has this one. This brand spanking new. Stick that one there. Perfect. <laughs> Very messy. <laughs> Very messy. <laughs> Okay, next award. Next award. What's the next award? The next award is one of the two big awards, and I don't know who's winning this one. <laughs> um, it's the blogger most valued member. Even though it just says most valued. But it's the most valued member. Wow. There were four of us that were nominated for this one. Jeez. The winner of the Blogger Most Valued Member Award is... Let me open it. <laughs> Let me open it. No, the... Oh, I did tell the nomin the people that were the crew members that were final finalists for the award were me, DJ Strawberries, I think. Yeah, Strawberries and I. The winner of the Blogger Most Valued Member Award is D DJ Pickle for, for the second year in a row. <laughs> for the love of God. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> uh, okay. Don't need to put a banner, it's already up there. See? It's already up here. Hey there, hello. I want to there. That's blogger. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Final award of the night, of the evening is. The biggest award we give out, the Discord Gamer of the Year Award. And the finalists for the Discord Gamer of the Year Award were DJ Pickle, Game Nader 5, and Strawberries. So. Let's open this envelope. Let's tell you who won it.
the winner for the second year in a row of the Discord Gamer of the Year Award is DJ Pickle. I need a sign. <laughs> where's the sign? For the love of God, where's the sign? <laughs> Hey, Discord Gamer of the Year 2018. He, need, he needs a fix. Hey, and that will do it for and that will do it guys for the awards and let's clean up from the awards and I'll uh, fix everything and yeah and it's time to head to what what's next whoa it's Something that is just gonna be this year, just I wanted to do it, being that um, this upcoming grad year is very close to us. So, the next part is called Our Grad. So, I will see you in that part. I need to um, reset and clean up. <laughs> okay, so... After fixing everything, I'm back. I'm ready. I'm ready to do this. I'm ready for this next section. And it is the, as I said, um, it's something that's only going to be this year because of uh, the 2020 grad class being very close to us. And uh, by the time we have the... <laughs> Your wrap up of 2020, it'll be about time to do the 2021 one, but there's a, we only know we don't know one in there. <laughs> so, um, want to do this for 2020, and uh, so for this year, the Innator Army has decided to dedicate this section to this upcoming grad class of 2020. So let's show you guys what we have concocted to say what we can to the grad class of 2020 right now. <laughs> and then we'll do whatever we'll do after that. This message goes out to the upcoming grad class of 2020 for the students going into school and the students graduating out of school and the students going into university or college. Going into school can be a hard thing, but in the long run it can help you become a better person. The road might be hard and rough, but you can always count on your friends to get you through it. So to those who struggle, to those who are strong, you need to get through, and the only way to get through is to start. So all you thinkers, all you smart people, all the people that might hide in the corners when people walk into a room, those who struggle beyond belief, there's always a way through, and you will always be students, no matter how old you are. 
even if you are fully graduating, you still are going to be a student. Just might not be the student at a school. Just still be a student to the generation before you, and you will be the teachers to the generations after you. This is the 2020 grad class, and you can make the world the way you want to make it. This is also our class. This is the world's class. So no matter So no matter where you are in the world, think of yourself as special as you want to be before it is too late. And have time with your friends, your family, before you travel and stay somewhere that you might put down roots. Just remember where you came from and who got you there. This is our grad class. Talk about quite the first quarter. That was in quite the intense first quarter. We had quite a bit get talked about, and honestly, uh, I think it turned out really well. Um, as the first quarter was kind of just us talking and the awards, a lot, lot of awards now. There's a lot of awards out there now for the, in the crew. It's insane. And, um, yeah. That, that last section you saw, that was, um... It was kind of uh, something that I decided to do, um, being that the grad class this year is very close to us, and um, so I decided to do that, and I decided to mix it up and also dedicate it to people going into school this year. So... Without that, besides that, there was a lot that was dis discussed in this first in the first quarter, and quite a bit discussed. Like that was insane. Like um, like uh, I don't, uh, <laughs> um. We definitely, uh, um, I think started this one off with quite the bang, but, um, the next, uh, quarter will definitely be the deciding factor if it's gonna be weird, as the next, uh, quarter is all the big briefings from all the groups inside us. So that's gonna be interesting, that's gonna be very, very interesting to see, and... We'll see what happens. I don't know what's gonna happen yet. And, uh, I don't know how it's gonna turn out, but, hey. So, it's gonna, it's gonna be fun the rest of this. We got two more quarters to go. We got another pre-show after this next quarter, and we will talk about what's uh, been unveiled in the second quarter. It's gonna be insane. So, uh, yeah. The second quarter is primarily briefings, uh, being that it's all of our groups showing off what they've done over the course of, uh, well, the year. 
one one of our groups has just been two months, but still pretty good. Uh, we got some trailers to show off in this next uh, part, and it's gonna be it's gonna be insane. So, yeah, I guess I there's nothing really other to than no, other to say, but um, that was insane. That was an amazing um part put together by um in the uh, in the last minute by the last minute so yeah and uh so let's move on next uh the briefing um portion of the year and wrap up and it's gonna be probably pretty long so near army I will see you back on the stage. Okay. We're back. For the big one now, ladies and gentlemen, this is the briefing part. This is the second quarter of the year end wrap up. We got a lot to talk about. It is now time to show you what our groups have been working on these last 12 months. It's time to show you what they've done. And it's time to make it official for certain things coming. Now, first things first, before we actually get straight into um, the briefings, the first one is of one of our groups that's brand new to the group as of July. So, it's going to be interesting to see how this is going to end up. And, um, so, yeah. And, um, yeah, let's, uh, head into the briefings. Let's have fun with this. Let's, uh, show you what we've made this, uh, this year. Okay. And it's time for the first of the briefings. So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Inator. Army Development Studios briefing for the year and wrap up of 2019. It is a big one. We got a lot to show you today. And, uh, yeah. So, this is weird. As you can see, like right here, I. I, you can't see like on the screen you have the um uh big thing this is going to be hard as it's really hard to get it to move so i'm going to have to do this that the United army development studios was started back in july of this year so th we have this hasn't have this hasn't had that long to make things and prepare things for this, but I think we got some then and uh we're proud to be here to show what we have been working on and what is coming so for the first time ever. Let's move to the next part of this presentation. As of July, the Inator Army started the development studio with one purpose. To make games for in the Minecraft Java Edition. 
with us starting in July, you would ex you would probably expect nothing to be ready, and just us telling you what might be what we probably will be working on for uh, next year. No, 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 and but now here's the weird thing: we actually brought a trailer to show you guys. So we want to show you that trailer right now of the project we have been working on since July. So let's show you the project to show you at right now. And uh, yeah. World premiere. That's right. In Air Army, we are proud to announce the first project that the Air Army Development Studios has been working on, and that is Apocalypse. It is coming. We already have a release date, but before I say that. Let's tell you some a bit about it. 
as you saw in the trailer, at the very end, there was a big uh, crater. And the nukes were dropped on um, a couple towns. Um, and, yeah, so, the world has been kind of abandoned, and, um, except for one place, just uh, off, just beside the, um, big crater, but, um, it's gonna be interesting to see, and, um, and, of course, with this project, there's gonna be levels, there's gonna be exploration worlds, a total of ten exploration areas in the world of Apocalypse, but, what, when can you guys be expecting to get your hands on this? Well, Ladies and gentlemen, you can be expecting to get your hands on Apocalypse. February 14th, 2020. That is right. Apocalypse is coming in this year, in the upcoming year, in February. So I hope to see you all when that comes out. But before we move on, we still got a bit to show you. We got a couple more things to show you right now. We don't got trailers for them, but hey, let's show you them. Here's another project started last week. This is the Hero Project. It is already it already has a release date, but it's not anywhere ne near us. But it's gonna be fun. It's the biggest one we have uh, in the works. And it's gonna be fun to see your guys' reactions when it comes out. So, of course, I said there's a release date. And that's the release date. Hero is coming October 16th, 2020. Almost a year from now. <laughs> yeah. And that's going to be fun. Heroes coming October 16th, 2020. It is going to be a blast. It is going to be fun. Let's have fun with it. Let's not make it stupid. <laughs> but there's going to be 10 exploration worlds. 21 levels. It is going to be insane. And you guys, I have a feeling, are going to have fun with this one. So, moving onwards. You might think, that's pretty good for being two months and you uh, have two projects. No, no, no. 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 I'm, you're, you'd be wrong. Boom! Third project. This is the last one. <laughs> Crusader. The Crusader project is coming also, and it is. Expected not any time soon, <laughs> but it is coming and it is going to be a blast. It's going to be fun, and of course, you can't have Crusader uh, come out and not have any uh, dates uh, be on the stage and not have a date set for it. Of course, we have a date, so let's show you it. Crusader is coming January 30th, 2021. It is coming. It is going to be awesome. So, stick with us. It is going to be fun. Crusader is coming. Hero is coming. And the big one, and that is Apocalypse coming this year, February. It is going to be fun. It's going to be awesome. We can't wait to see... to. Play it, of course, on the Nader Army channel. It will be covered. So, I'm um, just wanted to check. Yeah. So we will see you in February with Apocalypse. 
It is going to be fun. And I literally cannot wait. For, uh... Like, could February hurry up, please? <laughs> like, it's gonna be awesome. Okay. It's time. For near publishing, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the near publishing briefing of the year and wrap up. Now, if you didn't know, near publishing recently released near army earth control to the public. That was literally a couple weeks ago. So, what we took upon ourselves here was we put a bunch of the character names all throughout, all throughout. So, it's awesome, it's cool, the book's out, go buy it on Amazon, link is in the description, in the description below. But, before we get into, we're not here to talk about book one, we're here to talk about other books, and other series coming to the Inator Publishing Library over the course of probably the next couple of years. So, as you know, the book we just released, Nader Army Earth Control, is part is the first book of a fifteen book series called in in the Nader Army series. So, as of today, we are announcing the continuation of that series after book eighteen, and that is. The second generation. That is right, the second generation coming. It is the story of the kids in the at the end of the first series of the main series. And it's going to cover them on their adventures. They got one person from the main adventure, and that is DJ. He's sticking around in the Innator Army second generation. It is going to be a blast. We already have the five book titles and covers made. So let, let's show you the covers. I can tell you who the characters are going to be when I see a cover. So, yeah. Let's, uh, let's show you a cover. Let's show you book one's cover. Book one of an army second generation exam. It is one of probably the slickest looking uh, ones that I've made and uh, as you can see on there it has all the characters in the series. It has Gameinator 8, Inator, Cleo Inator, Zach Kaduki, Derek, KG Dino, Crystal, KG Dino, DJ, as I said, there's Xnet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Poe and Emma. <laughs> we got some interesting names here. <laughs> I will definitely say that. We got some interesting names. But, hey. Nader Army Second Generation Exam. It is going to be quite the interesting book, and it's going to be interesting to see their storyline get built um, beyond the last last eight <laughs> yeah yeah eight being they're in the final five then the other three so yeah eight <laughs> yeah yeah eight <laughs> so let's take a look at book two Nader Army Second Generation Book 2 has been titled Drop. It is a, another very nice cover. It is the exact same lineup as, uh, of characters as the first one. It is going to be insane. It's going to be fun. I can't wait to actually start writing these. So, yeah. Then book three, kind of building off the book that is 
at the moment about to enter productions, which is United Army Darkness Storm. And that one's about to enter productions, and along with that, the continuation of the story is the Nader Army Second Generation Abyss. It's gonna be awesome as Abyss. It's pretty much the same thing, just amped up. So, and with Abyss, we have the entry of a new character into the second generation lineup. That is Zeal. Uh, very, 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 very young. <laughs> but hey. So, that's coming, Abyss, and uh, it's going to be awesome to see all these on um, Amazon when I'm all said and done, and land, and sit back, on, or sit back in a chair, and could read them. It's going to be awesome, I can already do that with one of them. <laughs> so, book four, Titan! This one is insane. This one is the second to last in the series. It is going to be insane and it's Titan. It's a, it's a system that they go visit. They're traveling a lot in this series. It's going to be awesome. Again, the characters are listed all down the side. It is going to be one heck of a book. And, um, of course... Moving on from book four to book five, the final one of the second generation, Fire! And it is going to be awesome to see. Um, as you can see, this one is really insane looking. The cover, it is going to kind of close off everything and it's going to make you probably think again on the previous ones. Like, this one's gonna be insane. And, like I said for the previous ones, these are gonna be insane to write, and yeah. So, moving on, second generation, you're awesome! Besides the second generation, we also have the Inner Army Origin Stories! These will cover uh, the origins of all the main characters of the main series at the moment, not the second generation. If you guys want to see that, I'll put, I'll put covers together. Uh, I'll be annoyed, but I'll put covers together. But I thought, what a better way to unveil the origin story than on this field, on this stage, right now. So, that's right, it, the origin stories, 15 books spanning from my character to the my character's parents at the very end, it is going to be insane, it's going to be awesome, they're coming, they're going to be after the main series, so they're probably going to come out before the second generation goes out. It's gonna be awesome, and they're going to be a jump onto something that we haven't touched ever before. It's gonna be insane, it's gonna be awesome. Now, 15. It's two more characters that I'm wanting to announce their origin stories today. And that is Astro Karuti and Kite Karuti that are coming in book two. We did want to leave them out, so we brought we're bringing them in. Astro and Kite, they're coming in as book sixteen and seventeen. And of course, if you don't know, if you didn't see Nair Publishing's Media Day, we announced another new character coming to the storyline. But until before I 
do that and go to her, she will have an origin story, just it did not make her recover yet. You know, we're still building the character somewhat. So, stay with me and stick with me. These two are here and let's uh, show you the other two. The other character coming on in the Innator Army series, book three. So let's switch um sets. Let's go to a different part of the um uh stages and of the setup, and they'll see you there. Okay, for the Innator Army series, I decided to come up to where this uh pillar was. <laughs> Which is on the little boardwalk that we built um for Hop City when we got here this week. And um Yeah, so as you know, in Air Army Darkness Storm entries production this September. And with in in Air Army Darkness Storm we are bringing in a new character known as Spickles. And I told you that we would talk about her traits, her abilities. She's going to turn into one of the main characters of the storyline, starting in book three and onwards. And if you don't watch, if you haven't uh, read the series, I doubt you have. I'll uh, give you some context. Um. In the series, there's a couple characters at the moment. My character, DJ, Strawberries, and Sparky. The four of us have the ability... Uh, well, the four of us, when we were young, were given... um, Were experimented on with something called Experiment 77. Which gave us, at this point in time, powers. Combo powers and normal powers. So, as of today, we're announcing that Spickles, the new character coming in Book 3, has Experiment 77 running through her veins also. And it is going to be awesome to um, see this actually unfold in Book 3. See if what her combo ability will do, if it'll even show in Book 3, her main ability. So I want to tell you the abilities right now. I told you I would. And um of course being experiment 77, let's first cover her main ability. This will cover most of it and this will probably be the most common one used in book 3 and that is the ability known as Stardust. It's going to be insane. As Stardust it is literally going to be able to, um, well, blast stars out of her hands. It's gonna be insane! <laughs> as, uh... Nah, I'm not gonna say that. No, nah, I, was, I was gonna say, like Hulk said the <laughs> in uh, the first Avengers, we're, we're a time bomb. No, no, we're not that. Not yet, at least. <laughs> it's gonna turn into that, probably. But no, no, not yet. <laughs> but, um... Of course, I also said that Experiment 77, um... People have a combo ability. This was just touched on in Book 2, and I'll... At the very end. I'll, and I'll get on to Book 2 and at later. And, um, her combo ability, Spickle's com combo ability is fire and vines. It's gonna be insane. <laughs> Basically, it's going to, she's gonna throw vines, uh, like, launch vines out of probably her fingers, I'm going to say. And, uh, then they're gonna light on fire. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be real destructive, but it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome to write that. I don't know if that's gonna come in book three, but you know it's coming. It's gonna be fun. So beyond that, 
Let's move on. I'll stay up here. And let's move on. I told you I'd be here for this one. It's either Army Pixel Takeover. I told you that I'd be covering something here about it on Wednesday. And I keep up my promises. Near Army Pixel Takeover is complete. Near Army Pixel Takeover has completed production and the release date is now set. You cannot find it on Amazon yet. But it has a release date set and it's coming this September 15th. That's right, September 15th, an AI Army Pixel Takeover launches worldwide. And it's going to be awesome. I hope to see you all um, when that book releases. Of course, I'm going to do what I did for Earth Control. I'm going to unbox it here on the channel. It's going to be fun. It's going to be awesome. I'm going to do it for all of them. So, <laughs> my plan is to get uh, book two and book three out and possibly book four out this year. So... Stick with me! They're coming! <laughs> but now, I can work through these pretty fast. I got Pixel Takeover done in like a two week period. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm serious. I, I got done that fast and I, I didn't skip anything. <laughs> it's very high quality, I'll say that. Even though I got done in like two weeks. <laughs> but, um, yeah. I don't think there's much else for um for uh publishing to say, I don't think at least. Yeah, yeah. We'll see you in September at the release of In Your Army Pixel Takeover. I hope to see you all there. And um Guess we should move on to the next briefing. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, this is the Inner Army Video Services Briefing. It is going to be fun. And, of course, we got some stuff to show. Not as much as the other ones, but we still got some stuff to show. The last one's gonna have the most to show. But, hey! <laughs> That's more not there yet. <laughs> New Army Video Services here and wrap up briefing of 2019. Let's go. Let's get it done. Let's get it showed. Let's get what we're doing on this one shown to you guys right now. Let's do it. If you didn't know this, um, before this past year, we had a very awesome intro on the channel that a lot of you liked. Um, we called it the, I call it the spiral intro, and it was removed this past April. So. We're proud to announce that it is returning this upcoming season back to the channel it, it i am not lying it is coming the new spiral intro let's show you the new spiral intro right now and i mean right now let's show you it let's get it done let's show you the new spiral intro ladies and gentlemen this is the innator army new innator army's new intro for the upcoming season WASN'T THAT COOL? It's not long. Not that long. I like that. I like it. And, um... This time... Besides that one, we're also... BRINGING IN A NEW INNATOR MATURE! 
intro. That's right. And Name Mature is getting a new intro also. It is coming. And let's, of course, show you that also right now. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be epic. So let's show you it right now in Near Mature. New intro right now on this stage. So let's show you it. And yeah. Okay. Wasn't that cool? If you want to see that intro in action, go watch in their army. I a mature. This next season, starting this upcoming week on Thursday. Yeah. So yeah. Near, I am mature. In the arm, and getting new intros this year. They're awesome looking. But besides the new intros, the Nader Army, as you know, you might actually not know this. If you didn't know this, the Nader Army has a founder circle. And as of today, we are proud to announce. The f for the first time ever, in addition to the Founders Circle since 2013, when the three Founders were put on, me, Strawberries, and Sparky. And, of course, today I'm announcing the next member of the Founders Circle. The new member of the Nader Army Founders Circle. You've seen him, you know him, he's the winningest member, maybe, I don't know, it's really hard to tell now. DJ Pickle, welcome to the Nader Army Founder Circle! It is awesome to finally have someone like him on the crew, it's gonna be amazing to see what he can bring to the, um... Uh, uh, it is gonna be cool to see what um he can uh do to help with the channel now and yeah. Being that I won't get into the nitty gritty of Founder Circle. If you want me to, I'll do it at uh on the thirtieth of November. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So with that, let's pull a switch, let's change it to the place that has been hosting us this year. Let's switch it to Near Village. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Near Village slash City MC server. Year and wrap up briefing of 2019. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a big one. It is probably the proudest one that I'm, this is the one I'm the proudest to show, and we got quite a bit to show here. We got a total of two trailers to show in this one. It's going to be insane, and yeah. So, without further ado, let's move into Inner Village slash City MC server. Let's talk about what's coming. Like I said, we got a trailer to show all ya. So, I show you all ya the trailer right now. <laughs> World Premiere. <laughs>
Now, you might all be wondering, what? why a trailer for this? Well, as of this September, the Native Village will be launching to the world September 22nd, 2019. It will be launching for Minecraft Java Edition. Let's go, and ARA, you could now join the server on September 22nd. It is amazing to finally be able to share this with you, and it is going to be a blast to see you all running around this place. Now, with the server launching in September, of course, there's still a lot to get done. I'm going to be running around. I might not be streaming that much, but I'll be running around. I'll be fixing some stuff. I'll be building stuff. But now I want to. I want to allow you guys to be up, be able to actually live on the server when you get onto the server. So, launching September twenty second, twenty nineteen, and it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. So, let's move it on to the next one. And uh, well, actually, no. Ah, uh, what am I saying? With the server launching, we have a launch timeline for you all to see when things will be opening for the public on the server. It is, of course, there's a lot of places on the server you guys can go to. Just not right on September 22nd. We just can't open it all at once. So, let's show you. The launch timeline. Oh, well, actually, no. First, I'll show you this. These are pictures of the server at this moment. That one picture is the entrance to Nader City on MC Highway 1. And the other picture is the entrance to Nader City's suburb area on Victory Bridge. It's going to be fun to see you guys in these areas. And now, let's show you the launch timeline. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Inner Village slash City MC launch timeline. Launch day is September 22nd. Inner City will open to the public along with the Inner City suburbs. Then, later on September 22nd, Inner Village slash City will launch a live stream on the Inator Army channel. It is going to be fun. We're going to be streaming. We're going to be having a blast that day. That's September 29th. Hub City will open to the public along with Hub Town Memorial. Then fast forward into the next month, October 6th. Elephant Island will open to the public. And then, fast forward quite a bit later, on October 27th, Mini Games, Mini Game Studios will open to the public starting with Constant Kingdom. It, it's going to be fun to see that one. Of course, we're going to be playing in there quite a bit, probably on the weekends. But yeah, it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun to see all this happen. And of course, as we said on... Uh, as we said yesterday, the United Village has their expansions coming. So, we have an expansion timeline to show you all. So, the release of the expansions... Ladies and gentlemen, the expansion timeline for the server starting October 20th. Expansion 1, the For the Builders releases to the public. That's going to be awesome. There's quite a bit to uh, come out there. Expansion 2, the recorder releases on February 12th, 2020. And then fast forward June 9th, 2020. Expansion 3, The Fan, 
releases. Then fast forward, December 1st, 2020, Expansion 1 of Season 2, The Blizzard releases. Then, that next year, March on March 19th, Expansion 2 of Season 2, Slip and Slide will release. Then, on August 14th, 2021, Expansion 3 of Season 2, the Olympics expansion will release. That's right, those are all the expansions for Seasons 1 and 2. We got the release dates for them, we do not have the release dates for the 3 of Season 3. I'll announce them probably later, but hey. I said we have one more trailer with For the Builders coming very shortly after the server launches. Let's show you a trailer for the For the Builders expansion right now. Let's show you it right now in the army. Let's go. World premiere. That's right, for the builders coming, it's gonna be fun. We got an arena, we got a race track built. There's two more things that are needing to be built, okay? So, yeah, like I said, it's a big one. We haven't even built two things yet. So, Naomi, that's gonna about do it for the briefings. Let's head back to the free show, and we'll see you it on this stage in the final quarter. Let's go! Okay, we're back on the pre-show stage. Guys, wow. That was insane. Um, 
quite a bit is coming um this uh fall. Uh, I hope you guys are all looking forward to all that. It's going to take a lot of work. And, yeah, it's going to be awesome. And probably the biggest one we're probably going to be working on is, uh, is in Nader Village. I'm just saying. Not, no smack to them. They're the ones hosting us. <laughs> That's why they were last. They were leading out. Uh, we should have probably done them first, though. <laughs> but, hey! The second, uh, second bit is done. That was insane. We announced quite a bit there. And, to be honest, I, I don't know how long this is going to be rounding out at. Hmm. So, yeah. Um. Yeah, I, I think uh, now it's just the kind of nitty gritty stuff. It's the uh, final part of. It's the final quarter. It's gonna be fun. We gotta. Oh, count them out. We got six. Technically seven, but we got six on the stage, then the closing, and then you will be back out here for the after show. It's going to be awesome, and uh, yeah. So, Nay Army, I shouldn't hold you guys away from the big stage. It's the pre-show. It's over. It's time for the after show to kick in for afterwards. So, Nay Army... Let's head to the final quarter. Okay, and it's time for the final quarter. Let's go, Nader Army. Welcome to the final quarter quarter of this year's year and wrap up. This is the longest one we've done. <laughs> this really is, jeez, and. Let's start it off with the Nader Army Future. And this is something probably going to happen next year. So, let's uh, start it. Let's get it going. And let's see what happens with this final quarter. And it's going to be closing off probably one of the most historical moments on channel history. Before this year, um, the, the thought of this channel system lasting past the last year was slim. N and now with the success of the season of Infection, we are excited to say that the Inair Army will stick around after this next season. We are also proud to say that even now when the road in front of us is very faded and we can see it going for on for quite a while, even when this year is done. So onward, and let's hope that what comes in the future will be good, and that we will probably make friends along the way. Nader Army, We couldn't be more proud of how this channel turned out this past uh, season, and like I just said there, if it didn't turn out well this year, we could have easily just closed. But to be honest, this channel turned out so well this last season, and we're planning on sticking around for a uh, season after this one that's coming up. So, yeah, if we'll be sticking around after that, I don't know. Probably will be, but I don't know. So, Naomi, thank you for sticking with us these all all these years. And um, 
hopefully you guys will stick with us for the next couple, and, uh, let's try to get, keep this going. It's gonna be fun. Now, MOVING ONWARDS! If you didn't see the video that we was posted on Tuesday, we announced that the Inner Army will start streaming to the platform known as Mixer this fall. Um, yes, we are, uh, going to officially start streaming this, uh, probably September? I don't, I don't know when the first stream will be in September, being that it's monthly. Um, but it's gonna be fine. We're gonna have quite the blast out here. Um, and yeah. So, Nay Army, I hope you guys will stick with the, uh, follow us on Mixer and stick with us here. We will st start streaming again every week on this channel and every week on twitch.tv slash Nader Army. With the Saturday fun day streams here and the Sunday fun day streams over on Twitch. It's gonna be fun. And, uh, yeah. Along with Mixer, we announced that we will ne be, n that we will now be posting on Tumblr. Yes. We have already technically started. Every video that has uploaded since that day has been posted to Tumblr. So, you guys can find these videos pretty much everywhere. <laughs> and, um, yeah. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be insane. And in your army, I hope you guys will stick with us on our social media. It's the best way for you guys to know if a video is still late. If a video is, um, if there's gonna be a special video on a day. And if you want to be even more in it, follow all of us. <laughs> follow all the social media platforms. Be that the Nair Village has the Twitter and Instagram. The book series has Instagram and Twitter. We have Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, and a bunch of others. Go check description. They're all listed there. And, uh, yeah. Uh, even though we're going to be posting like crazy on to Mixer, that still will not affect the quality of content that we will be produ producing on the channels that uh, video services uh, controls. So, yeah. Now, moving onwards, next part, this is a big one, Gaminator of the Year voting. This one's something we do every year, let's move around, let's go over here. The Game Nair of the Year voting for this upcoming 2019-2020 voting uh, section. It's going to be different than ever before. As, um, well, if you haven't been around on the channel long, you wouldn't know that we do this. But every, every year we do, we go through a voting period from the end of August. To the be to the beginning of January, technically the end of December, but the beginning of January, um, or more December, like I have here, called the Game and Era of the Year voting. It is probably the one thing that we take a lot of time to count and do and stuff. And as you saw this year, DJ uh got crowned. Game Nader of the Year. He's going for it again. <laughs> and for the first time in the voting six-year history, 
There is a group of three running together to try to clinch the title of Game Leader of the Year. I guess I could tell you who's, uh, who's, um, grouped up. It's DJ! Me! And I! Three of us have grouped up, me and DJ have won, we're trying to get I her first ever Game Nader of the Year! Um, banner onto her pillar. So, it's gonna be fun, we're gonna try our hardest to get her that. And, um, yeah. Now, um, voting is going to be fun this year, and you can actually, um, s starting this video, you can actually vote. In the comment section of this video, just leave the vote codes. I will show you all the vote codes of the people. Everyone, start over here! Eee! Woohoo! There's Weird, whose vote code is alive, so you just put alive in the, um, as a comment. Then there's Potato, who has won it, and his vote code is Potato. There's also a Couch, his, his vote code is Controller. Doc, and his vote code is Unknown. There's Schmerich, and his vote code is Airy. It's I, and her vote code is Disney14! There's Strawberries, and his vote code is mine. There's me, and my vote code is G5! Then there's DJ, his vote code is Pickle. There's Sparky, his vote code is Lego. And Diamond, and her vote code is Cats. So yeah, those are all the vote codes. You just need to put one of them in the description below. And that will count as the vote. And yeah. So moving onwards, let's actually show you something. As you know, every year we put a banner up there showing the new... Uh, season. This is the time we're showing the new season. I don't know where it is. It's up here. <laughs> yeah, that's not creepy. This is the banner and the season that we are about to go into after this video ends. Is the year of the red lens. That's seven seasons, guys. This is the seventh season of the Inayer Army's history coming. Today! It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be nerve wracking, being that I don't know how we're gonna top this one. <laughs> now, before we end off this year's year end wrap up. We would like to show you the location of next year's year-end wrap-up. So let's show you it right now. Let's uh, show you.
So, that's right. Next year's year and wrap up will take place at the Galactic Burial Center on the Innator Village server in Innator City. We will also be taking control of Sunshine Armor uh, Center, which is right next door. And yeah. From now, it's time to close off this year and wrap up. In the army, we would like to thank you. We would like to thank Hop City for hosting this summer's festivities and for tolerating the stuff we did this summer. <laughs> so, for all of us here at the Innator Army, we would like to thank all of you for watching this year's year end wrap up. And we look forward to seeing you all in the next years. So thank you and stay cool and have fun. Stay see you later in Nader Army. Stay cool and have fun. See you later in Nader Army. Don't forget to like the video, favorite the video. Share the video with your family and friends. And I hope to see you all in the next video. See you later in Nader Army. It's going to return back to normal this week. And we're out of the Summer of Power. See you later in Nader Army. Uh, this is Game Nader 5 signing off. See you later in Nader Army. Ladies and gentlemen, that will do it for this year. Welcome to the after show. And oh my goodness, that was insane. The amount we unveiled today. Did you see all of that? It was insane. Of course you saw it if you're at the after show part. It's insane. Thank you for watching it. And um, it's going to be insane to see all this roll out this year. And the... Year of uh, the Red Lens. Uh, that's that's a nice one. That's a nice banner. I definitely want that banner up in my room in in the near army household. Um. So, uh, what was before we go today? Want to know what was your guys' favorite part of this year's year end wrap up? Was it the briefings? Was it all of our lectures, all the awards? Let me know in the comments section below. Don't forget to vote. Voting ends January. It starts today. Don't forget to vote. I will probably be in the comments section voting right after the video is live. So, um, vote, guys. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a fun year. Let's hope we can, um, pull it off and... Get that, let's get I her first uh, Game Nerd of the Year. Let's do it. She's grouped up with me and Pickle. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we can pull it off this year. The three of us. <laughs> so, in the army, before I fully go away and leave you guys to have a good couple days before school goes back in, if you're going back into school, if you're not, no, no, no have fun. <laughs> I fun out of school. <laughs> Let's blow out this big giant torch. Nader Army, that will do it. Thank you all for watching this summer. It was fun. We had our kick at the cat this summer and. 95 views this August, I do believe. A big, big, big amount of views this August. That's what make it. That's what's making this all worth it. See you later in the army. This is Game Nerd Five signing off. After show off and year and wrap up of 2019 is officially done. See you later in the army. See you in 2020. See you at the Galactic Burial Center next year, and it's gonna be awesome. I need to edit this, so see you later in the army.